Hey everyone, I am Maggie and I am a reseller on platforms such as eBay, Amazon, Etsy, and Poshmark, among others. So today I'm doing some listing on eBay and I thought I would share a quick, simple trick on how to ease the pain of those dreaded item specifics when you're listing. So let's get watching. Now you can argue up and down and we can discuss from here to Sunday the what I consider the actual ridiculousness of the amount of item specifics that have to be entered, especially when other platforms seem to have literally no problem getting our items found and sold without all that rigmarole. However, it is what it is. So, so when you're s selling on the eBay platform, as you know, there are all these item specifics that uh, eBay asks you to fill in. And my trick right off the top of the bat is enter as many of those things into the title before you, as you begin, and they will automatically populate into the eBay form. So to demonstrate, <clears throat> I have a dress that I'm listing today. It's a really cute sundress which if it was my size would not even be being listed so that's what i'm doing today and i instead of going through and and entering all those different specifics that ebay requires of us in clothing i'm going to enter as much of it as i can into the title and see what happens so what i have is a lucky brand mini sundress it is blue with a floral pattern. It is sleeveless, has a drawstring waist, and it is fully lined. And it is, has like a, a boho festival kind of vibe. And I think that is everything that I wanted to say about it. Okay, and now I'm gonna choose here women's clothing and dresses so it'll populate the, the right item specifics so here it brings me to the form and as you'll see i'm pointing to the screen like you can see my finger as you will see all of these item specifics have already automatically updated so let's go down and take a look in the required item specifics these are things you must put on in order to list the item you won't be able to list it without it's filled in for me the brand it's filled in the sundress however you see here it needs to be up here with a check it needs to be up here so in, in order to get it there you can't just click the add button you must click into that box and then click add and that will put it up there and that's how you know it's actually filled in size you have to fit in the regular size and obviously it's not picking up the size at all. It picked up the dress length was short. It picked up that it was a women's dress and it, the color. Now here's another, a little trick. When filling in these kind of multiple choice thingies, instead of clicking the arrow and scrolling through, just start typing your color and it will pop up for you. Okay, that's the recommend, that is the required specifics. Now, just a little talk about the recommended specifics. There are people on two ends of the spectrum, people who fill in almost nothing and people who obsess over getting every last specific in they possibly can. Okay. You need to be somewhere in the middle. You want to fill in those things that you feel like people are most going to be searching for. And eBay makes it easy by showing you right here, it starts with the most filtered cat filtered categories basically and it goes down to the least filtered so not nearly as many people are going to be searching for closure as are, go are going to be searching for sleeve length for instance so try to fill in as many of these big big guys as possible it already filled in sleeveless for me it already filled in the floral pattern pop in the occasion people apparently really search for that pop in the material and you know if you were to type in the material in the um title it would it would come here too and um other things you could put in or if there are any accents or you know if it was embroidery or anything like that you could fill in any of that um and the reason simply being that a customer who is going to search 
a customer who might be searching for a dress that is sleeveless, she might type in blue dress and then she thinks, oh, I want sleeveless. She'll filter by sleeveless. You may have a gorgeous blue sleeveless dress. If you don't fill this out, once she filters, your listing is gone. She'll never even see it. So, or yeah, she'll never even see it. So that is the reason you should fill in as many of these as you possibly can. Now, other end of the spectrum. The only way to get this little, I know people who obsess over getting this circle filled out. Well, the only way I know how to do that is to fill in every teensy character. Most clothing is not going to have a character. Um, sleeve type, you know, most, some sleeves are just, they're just not of any particular type. Don't obsess over it. Don't obsess over it. Fill in as many as you can quickly using typing in the box instead of using the multiple, you know, the drop down. Get it over quickly. The bottom line is the least amount of time, the less time you spend on list. this listing is the more time you can spend creating another listing. That's where your money is, creating the listings. So that is it. That's just my little, my little tip for trying to take as much of the pain out of it as specific as you possibly can. So don't forget that every Monday through Friday, every uh, weekday morning at 9 a.m. Eastern, the Reseller Squad chats about all things reselling plus more on Chick Picker channel, and that will be linked in the description box down below. Thanks so much for watching.